Hi, I'm Pew Whisper Lou from Evil Geniuses Dota, and I'm here to present to you Dota Hero Pro Tips brought to you by Peregrine. Today, the segment will focus on the Sand King, one of my personal favorites. The Sand King is usually the initiator in teamfights and in lane. In teamfights, the epicenter that it has gives massive damage in an AoE and also slows the enemies, making it ideal for setting up a huge battle. In lane, however, the Burrow Strike is the skill of choice as it is an instant stun that stuns a bunch of enemies and hopefully sets up your lane mate for an AoE follow-up stun. Now what people don't realize about the Burrow Strike in lane is that you don't actually have to get all your damage from just the Burrow Strike and the attacks that you get off while the enemy is stunned. If you aim your Burrow Strike correctly so that you position yourself behind your enemy so that when they make their retreat you can impede and block their movements, you can actually buy your lane mate and the creeps that are attacking the enemy an extra 4 or 5 seconds in which they can get more attacks off and maybe even cool down some spells to throw those off as well. And maybe this will be the difference between getting a first blood and not. So let's go to the game now so I can show you this Dota Pro tip. As you can see, my Sand King is level 4. The Burrow Strike is level 2 and key to this touch point on my Peregrine. The Sandstorm is there for emergency purposes so I can go invisible. And is key to this point on my touch point, my, my uh, Peregrine. And Caustic Finale is there for giggles. So let's unpause and show you this pro tip. Now my enemy is up here and it's the pirate Kunkka. And as you see, as we approach each other and engage, I will stun not on it with my click, but I will stun behind it. So that I end up behind it, get my attack off, and when he gets unstunned, I will actually move in front of him and zigzag back and forth in front of him to prevent his movement. That will buy you an extra few seconds for your teammate to attack him, throw more attacks off, and for him to take more hits from whatever is attacking him. And maybe that'll be the difference for your first blood. For more Dota Pro tips and information on the Peregrine, please visit theperegrine.com.